Eric, when you think Warren, many think Massachusetts, but back in the 1960s, Warren studied here at the University of Houston. A decade later, she taught law here on campus. In the 1970 U of H yearbook, a class photo captured Elizabeth Warren as a senior. Fast forward about 50 years, she's now a leading candidate for president. My office was here. In a campaign video, Warren returned to campus this summer, reminiscing about her time as an instructor. Well, Elizabeth is someone I've known for 40 years. Retired law professor John Mixon worked with Warren in the late 1970s and early 80s. Mixon told us Warren even asked him for teaching advice. We made a fairly regular routine of meeting for lunch at uh, a Mexican restaurant in the Heights. And uh, we talked about the uh, course that she was teaching, how things went that day, things that uh, might be used to engage the students a little better. Mixon supports Warren's candidacy, saying she's thoughtful, determined, and won't back down from a fight with President Trump. She will dominate him. She is, she is not a shrinking violet. On the campaign trail, Warren often talks about U of H as a commuter college, costing 50 bucks a semester. The tuition went from $700 a year to $100 a year, so it became much more affordable. University archivist Mary Manning says the campus Warren once walked on grew into a powerhouse institution. Uh, but it was a very interesting time period that she was here. We have grown so much uh, to being a school of 46,000 and being a tier one university. Manning says Warren's campaign continues to promote interest in the history of UH. We've got a lot of great stories on U of H and she's one of those stories. So after leaving the University of Houston, Warren went on to teach at the University of Texas. She's going to be back in town, of course, on Thursday for the presidential debate, this time as one of the front runners.